Hi, my name is uh, Professor Rudo Makunike Mutasa. I'm a pathologist and I'm very pleased that uh, Zimbabweans are wanting to become aware. So in October, we particularly are aware of breast cancer, but it brings to light all cancers. Cancer is no longer a scary word. God has not given us a spirit of fear, a timidity, but one of power and a sound mind. So let's not be afraid of cancer. Let's deal with it head on. The earlier you pick it up, the more likely you are to survive. Early detection saves lives. Go and get tested today. Thanks. Uh, I'm Dr. Mpangabue, a pathology registrar. Uh, guys, can you be with us? We are actually in the lab and there are some background noises. So the topic for today is about breast cancer. So right here, as you can see, we have a breast. And this breast was removed um, because of um, this patient was suspected to have breast cancer. So this is a breast specimen. As we can see, there is this overlying skin, though the nipple uh, is missing on this specimen. When we flip it over, this is the surface. This breast has been inked to look at the margins. But breast components include um, fat tissue. If you could feel, there are these hard areas which were in this breast tissue. That's the cancer we are talking about today. The incidence at which breast cancer is diagnosed is usually after the age of 50, but breast cancer can also be diagnosed before 50. Uh, the major symptom for breast cancer is a painless branched lump. Uh, so in most people, uh, the breast will not be painful, but it's pain, painless breast lump. And because the cost of treatment is far higher when the disease is spread, early detection is the key in the management of breast cancer. Other sim symptoms or other signs of breast cancer, though some may be late, include nipple invasion, ulceration, skin dimbling, and nipple discharge. Some of the risk factors which predispose one to breast cancer include, as we have already mentioned, age if you are above 50, sex if you are female, but also it occurs in males if there is a positive family history of breast cancer. We are saying if you have a family member diagnosed with breast cancer before, the risk of you having breast cancer is quite high. Um, also, previous uh, hormone, uh, re previous radiation exposure and smoking have been implicated as causes of breast cancer. The goal for management in breast cancer is early detection. As we have said, the cost of treatment with advanced disease is quite high. How does one detect this disease early? It's through self-examination, uh, and if you are married, examination by your partner. So normally it's a firm breast, it's a firm lump in the breast which is not painless. And if one notices this, it's advised to seek medical attention and the management of breast cancer, if one, if all this fails and one has breast cancer, it's mainly through surgery, which is, mast which is mastectomy or removal of the whole breast, as which is in this case. Other options include chemotherapy, radiation, immune therapy, and targeted therapy. How does one prevent having breast cancer? The answer is complex as some of the causes of breast cancer are genetic. But uh, maintaining a healthy diet, losing weight, regular exercises, and stopping smoking if you already smoke or avoiding smoking may have been found uh, to decrease the risk of getting cancer. But the message for today and the most important thing is early detection, which we said can can be done by regular self-examination. I thank you.